Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and this is the Framework laptop, which is a little different from most laptops in the market in that it's designed to be modular, upgradable, customizable, and repairable. So uh, the first thing that you'll notice about this laptop is that while there are four port sections here, they're all sort of customizable. So they use uh, these USB 4 or Thunderbolt uh, style ports to let you choose, do I want to have a USB type A port or a USB type C port or a display port? or HDMI or ethernet. Uh, and so there are a bunch of different ports that you can choose when you purchase it. And you can buy more than you need and swap them out as you go. Um, each of the ports locks pretty firmly into place when you just sort of press. And they can be kind of tricky to get out, but if you just sort of hold down the button and pull, they can be removed. Now, the other thing that really makes this unusual though is that it comes with this tool in the box, which has a little uh, sort of screwdriver that is designed to work with all of the screws anywhere you find on the laptop. And on the other end is a little prying tool that actually lets you open up the case. So I've already loosened all of these screws. They don't come all the way out. Um, and then the next step is to use that prying tool to sort of work your way around the edges to open the chassis. Uh, chassis. And once you've done that, you can sort of flip it over and take the keyboard right off. Now the keyboard is held uh, to, or is connected via this little connector, but once you pop that off, you have access to the insides. Um, and that brings us to a couple of the other things that really make this unlike most laptops on the market. Uh, so the first, it actually has a 61 watt hour battery in this version. Uh, earlier framework laptops came with a 55 watt hour battery, but you can upgrade to the 61 watt hour battery if you want, because it is the same physical size. And it does actually say right on the battery, this battery is replaceable. You might notice there's also a QR code. You can scan that. It'll take you right to the Framework website to buy a replacement battery. Uh, all of the parts are pretty much replaceable and uh, purchasable from Framework. And this particular model that we're looking at is the Framework Laptop 70, uh, AMD 7040 series model, which is the first to feature an AMD processor. Uh, Framework has released versions with 11th gen, 12th gen, and 13th gen Intel Core processors, but the 13.5 inch Framework laptop all basically has the same physical dimensions, which means you can even remove the motherboard from an earlier model, buy a brand new motherboard, and change an Intel model into an AMD model if you already have one. Um, or you can do individual sort of upgrades. So underneath this, we've got our you know, uh, RAM, which is pretty easy to upgrade and replace without a screwdriver. Uh, the SSD, this particular model has a 512 gigabyte SSD. There are also versions that will ship with uh, 256 or one terabyte, or you can purchase your own. And again, all you need to do is use this tool to sort of release that and it'll pop right out. Uh, the speakers, the memory card, everything is pretty much user replaceable as is the bezel around the screen, which can be replaced. And this particular model actually comes with a matte non-glare display. Uh, earlier versions had a glossy screen. So the idea here is pretty much everything is replaceable. So if you break a display, you can replace the display without buying a whole new laptop. If you want to upgrade the processor, you can buy a new mainboard with that new processor without buying a whole new laptop. Um, or if you just want newer parts, you know, for instance, you don't like the glossy screen that came in in the earlier version, you can replace it with this matte display. Uh, so the idea is that you can hang on to at least parts of your laptop for longer. Now this does come at a cost. The entry level DIY configuration, which doesn't have any memory or storage, just a framework laptop for this year's model with an AMD Ryzen 5 uh, 7640 processor starts at about 849 and that's without memory and storage or an operating system. Uh, prices start at about 1049 for a pre-configured system and they go up from there if you wanna get a system that does have a Ryzen 7 processor, that does have the most memory and the most uh, RAM uh, or uh, uh, storage. But again, you can sort of provide those on your own and you can also purchase the ports that you're gonna want. Uh, Framework also recently introduced a Framework Laptop 15 for the first time. Now that's the first model that is actually gonna have different internals in terms of sizing and placement, but it also has uh, additional port sections, including a modular port in the back that can be used for high-speed data connections for things like uh, discrete graphics. That's not available in the 13-inch models, but the 13-inch uh, models still 
are all pretty much interchangeable, which is uh, pretty impressive at this point now that we're on the third generation of framework laptops. So uh, to put everything back in place, you just need to pop the keyboard back in, snap the uh, whole thing back into place, flip it over, tighten those screws, and then you should be able to power up and use it like any normal laptop. So in this video, I just wanted to do a quick overview of the sort of modular, repairable, and upgradable components and show that if you watched a video that I recorded a couple of years ago with the um, Framework Laptop 12th generation, uh, it will look very, very similar. The main difference here is that we have switched to an AMD processor, uh, a bigger battery, a matte display, but the overall system actually looks very, very similar to what we were uh, getting from Framework for the last couple of years. So they keep making these upgrades, but it doesn't necessarily mean that you need to buy a whole new computer to access uh, those new features. Stay tuned, I will have um, more videos and uh, information on lilliputing.com about performance of this, the new AMD powered version, which is uh, now available from Framework.